How do pool pros seem to make the game look so easy? Do they know something we don't know? I was so desperate to find out, so I decided to dig into it, and I discovered something. Something that has really changed my game. And no, it's something you really can't see, but when you understand it, it makes so much sense. Now, the pros are the best at all aspects of the game. That's why they're pros, and we aren't. As you guys know, my YouTube channel is about the struggles of being an average pool player. So I really wanted to know, what does it take to become good at pool? I mean, come on! What's the secret? Let's get to work. I studied professionals. I compared them to footage of myself. I took notes and after a while, I started to see a very clear pattern. And when I compared older footage of me to newer footage, even though I could see my technique improving over time, I was still missing something really important. What I'm talking about is this. Be more aggressive. But not the kind of aggressiveness we usually think about when it comes to pool. Playing aggressive is much more than just choosing to try and pocket a ball instead of playing safe. You'll see what I mean in a second. Now take a look at these two clips. First, we have Eklund Kachi playing position from the 2 ball to the 3 ball. He draws the cue ball and lands perfectly on the 3, ensuring position for the 4 ball. Notice the distance the cue ball actually needs to travel. And then you have me, replicating what I typically would do in the same situation. So what I learned from studying the pros is this. Too many of my shots are longer than necessary. Being aggressive when you play position will enable you to go from this to this. And I think of it as aggressiveness, since the position area usually is more narrow the closer you get to the object ball. You don't need to go super close, but probably closer than you're playing for today. Even when you're crossing your position zone, maybe you should aim to land here instead of here. This shot is much more difficult than this shot. We all know the feeling from missing a position. And we're so afraid of it that we'd much rather play multiple longer shots than risk winding up without a shot. But a series of longer shots often results in a miss, ending the run. And we usually see that as poor shot making skills, when in reality, the problem may be the position play. Also, constantly playing position for longer shots will tend to make you shy away from bigger angles, since bigger angles and longer distances severely increases how difficult a shot is. The problem with this is that we actually need the angles to get proper position. Now, how do you become more aggressive in your position play? I think the most important thing is to accept that you're going to miss your position from time to time. The way you react to this is key. Accept it as part of the process. In fact, you should embrace it since it's a sign that you're becoming more aggressive. And remind yourself that the alternative of constantly leaving yourself longer shots or shots without a proper angle is not any better. Getting better at pool is much more than what I've just showed you. But this is potentially something that can level up your game without much effort. You just need to adapt a new mindset. There aren't any magic drills that will fix this. In fact, in this video, I go through why drills might be overrated.